What's up, y'all? Today I'm gonna be checking out Prince's Love Symbol album. I have not heard a single track off of this album. Yeah, rare, very rare thing when I have not heard a single track off of the album. But I'm very excited to check this one out. This is following Diamonds and Pearls. Really, really enjoyed that album, man. I thought that album was amazing. There were a couple of tracks on Diamonds and Pearls I wasn't like a huge, huge fan of. Uh, which ones were those? Uh, I think it was. Uh, like Daddy Pop and Thunder, literally like the first two. Like Thunder was cool, but I just didn't find myself going back to it. Same thing with Daddy Pop, uh, Dimes and Pearls, Classic Cream. I thought it was pretty good. It wasn't like super amazing, but it was all right. Uh, Strolling, phew, one of my favorite songs off of this album. Uh, Willing and Able, that was the one with the rap, right? Yeah. I was the one with the rap. Uh, Get Off. Ooh, Get Off was a classic song, man. That song is, yeah, huge, huge song. Uh, walk Don't Walk. Jughead. I, I like Jughead a lot, actually. Uh, I don't remember Walk Don't Walk. Money Don't Matter Tonight was amazing as well. Really enjoyed that. That's probably one, like, one of his deepest songs I've ever heard, honestly. Um, got Push. Uh, I slightly remember that one. I think that's the one where Prince rapped. And then Insatiable was amazing as well. Uh, Live for Love. I don't remember that one too well either. But overall, man, I really enjoyed the Diamonds and Pearls album. Just the overall feel of it and everything. Really enjoyed the direction of that album. But, um, yeah, like I said, today we're going to be checking out the Love Symbol album, which is slightly, you know, longer than uh, Diamonds and Pearls by just about 10 minutes. Um, and I'm very excited to check it out. Very excited. Uh, we have... One, two, three, five singles um, on the album. And uh, the first one is My Name is Prince. I haven't heard it, haven't seen the video. Also, the morning papers. Like, I remember, like, there was, like, I want to say, like, a couple weeks back from now, from where I am now, um, everybody was, like, reacting to that particular song, The Morning Papers. I saw like 50 reactions to Prince, The Morning Papers. So I don't know what that was about, but uh, I can't wait to check it out as well, see what the hype was about. But um, yeah, I said we just go ahead and start this album. Track number one, My Name is Prince. Tony M, so we might have a rap on this one. We got a music video as well, of course. Good evening, I'm Lauren Green. Uh, we have a disturbance in downtown Minneapolis. The details okay. are sketchy right now, but we're going to go live to Vanessa Bartholomew, who is in downtown Minneapolis right now. Vanessa, Production what can quality you tell us? Goes up once uh, yes, again. Lauren, I'm here. I, I, it's a little bit hard to hear you, so I'm just going to try and uh, update you on what happened. Uh, apparently, Prince and the NPG were uh, staging a free concert at Paisley Park. A few hundred kids showed up only to find a group of imposters on the stage. There was apparently some sort of a glass tube with a mannequin in it dressed as Prince. Why do I feel like this is based on real life events? Then a video screen came down to show that Prince and his band were actually here in Minneapolis at their nightclub, the Glam Slam. And that's when the violence started? Yes, kids practically tore up the backstage at Paisley Park. Several of the people were hauled off to the hospital. It doesn't seem to be any serious injuries, just minor cuts and bruises. And now, as you can see, just around the corner, back, back at the Glam Slam, I am sure you can hear the music. A near riot has broken out with kids dropping traffic to watch Prince and his band filming a music video in the back alley behind the Glam Slam. Vanessa, we hear the police have been called in. Is that right? Yes, yes, the police have been called, but believe it or not, and we don't. Uh, they, they are allowing the filming to continue. It's, it's just a real mess out here. This is Vanessa Bartholomew live. I don't recognize her. My name is
Yeah, I really like this like direction he's going in. Like ever since the Diamonds and Pearls album, like this track in particular is like it's got like the same qualities that uh like Get Off had. You know, like that super funky kind of like uh bass heavy R and B feel. Like I don't know what it is exactly, but it's it's amazing, man. And I'm really enjoying this. I'm really digging this one. <laughs> Definitely said like I feel like the tone for this album honestly holy crap that was like a super hype funky like that was incredible man and combined with the video which I, I thought the video was actually pretty cool I like that he's stepping his production quality up gradually over time as well but uh yeah this was definitely insane man really enjoyed this song can't wait to see you know the next song the follow-up to this um hey Okay, so this should be a pretty interesting next song. But uh, yeah, this song uh, was definitely nice, man. The rap. I thought the rap. I have to go back and really listen to the rap. But uh, I thought, like, you know, it was good. I don't know how good it was lyrically, but I thought it was it fit, you know. But um, yeah, that was My Name is Prince. If you guys enjoyed the reaction, make sure you smack the like button. Subscribe if you're new. That being said, much love. Stay safe and peace out.